Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm here back at my camp and today I would came out here to explain a lesson on astral or travel altars, travel traveling altars. I have one here with me that I painted the other day. And within is the ingredients to my travel altar. But first, I would like to take you through an explanation of the painting that I've done onto this travel altar. So along the, the base here, around here, it represents trees or the silver branch, silver trees around a lake. And then on the bottom, or is a starry night. I, I tried to make it starry. And on the top is the the moon. So this would represent the land with the trees and the water, the sea, from the water at the base of the trees around an ocean maybe and the stars for a sky so land sea and sky so that is what the painting on this travel altar represents and in a moment I'm going to show you the inside of my travel altar stay tuned bear with me a moment while I put on my gloves sorry about this <laughs> I dropped it as well. Yeah, so sorry about that. Uh, just have to clean the lens here. I dropped my phone into the snow. But anyway, you can place the travel altar on anything. A stone, perhaps, or a log, such as this one. Or like, like a, a rock, a big rock of some kind. And within my travel altar, If I can get it open now, hold bear with me. <laughs> so sorry about the delay, but within my travel altar, I do have a feather, which represents the sky. A... Pine cone. And a quartz stone crystal, which represents land, as well as a seashell, a seashell, which represents the sea. So again, land, sea, and sky is represented within this travel altar. And setting up on a table you may now kneel and pray to your gods or deities. As well, I do have a table set up that I would like to take you through on a later video for the travel altar setup. It uh, involves, it is made from a folding chair, a fold foldable chair, as well as a skateboard to put onto the, the folding chair to make a table for your altar setup and so I'm just gonna put away my stuff and that was my video on traveling altars and this is my travel altar that I've made the other day with the land sea and sky represented 
in painting and it's just made from a weed can I know weed is legal here now and this is what they sell the weed in so it's just a cool idea to make a travel altar and I hope that you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and stay tuned for my next video which will be either music or my travel altar table setup so God bless and many blessings blessed be bye